Well, Shane, we started talking at the beginning of the season and, you know, high hopes and, and Carlos obviously uh, got that victory. But for both of you, it just seems that a little bit of the edge has gone off the team. No, I don't think that's very fair to say. I think that uh, we've got a wonderful team. Um, obviously, uh, the last round at Monza was difficult for us, but we kind of expected that, and I think it was difficult for, for Ducati in general. I think that uh, all the times the rules remain the way they are, it's going to be, uh, you know, any of the longer, faster circuits are going to be difficult for Ducati. But, you know... Um, you know, like I said we got a, we got a great team, and you know the morale's real high in the team. And you know, hopefully this weekend we can be we can be really really strong and get back up close to the front again. To be fair, like you say, it is highly critical given the championship this year, which is so tight because you only have to look at any of the, the, the sheets, and you only need to be two tenths off, and it looks like anyway a disaster where it isn't. Yeah, exactly. I mean, uh, to be fair, I need a little bit more than two tenths right now, but. Uh, you know, it's, uh, it's all good. I think that uh, we've seen this weekend so far that anybody's capable of putting in a, a fast lap, but nobody's capable of maintaining it, um, including myself. Um, you know, I messed up a little bit this afternoon. Uh, I pushed hard with a new tyre on and pushed a little bit too hard and, and run wide in a couple of places, but, you know, still went the fastest I've been all weekend. So it's a little bit of a case of at the moment for me just to kind of slow down a little bit to go faster again, you know. So I'm trying to uh, trying to rush everything and we just need to keep plugging away the way we normally do and, you know, improve the bike, improve the bike, and then step by step the lap time will come. And again, uh, all right, you may not be winning all the races, but again, you're, the factory team is your benchmark, and frankly, they definitely aren't having the season that we expected from them. It's been uh, it's been a tough season for them for sure. Um, you know, Carlos done a wonderful job for us at the beginning of the season. Uh, had that win in Phillip Island, and uh, he's had a few podiums since as well. And uh, you know, I'm fairly desperate to have my first podium this year. Um, I'm looking forward to you know to standing on the top there and and you know and being really really happy. But uh, you know, we're plugging away, and like you said earlier on, you know, a, a tenth here or a tenth there is so critical. And uh, you know, sometimes the, the, the speed's identical, but if you've not got the, the position off the grid to, to get up the front, then, uh, you know, then the game's over, really. So we've got to work hard this weekend, like I said, and just trying to improve the step, step by step, and then hopefully we'll be, you know, there or thereabouts for Sunday. It's talking to people like Johnny Ray and, and Leon Haslam, and, and they said because it's so close, it, it is almost a case of a rider who really wants it at a particular track. Uh, for your style and for the way you go about it, uh, would a track like Kyle Army, where it is bumpy, it is tough and technical, or would a, a place like Miller, where everybody's you know, not had too many laps around there, be beneficial to you, or, or Silverstone, where nobody's been yet? <laughs> to be honest with you, I think uh, we've got quite a good run coming up for us now, because, uh, like I said to you earlier on, you know, Monza was always going to be difficult, and we knew that, but uh, now we've got here, which should be uh, fairly kind of friendly to our bike, uh, we've got Mizano coming, which is, again, you know, I had a podium there last year. Um, what else have we got? You know, a few, a few decent rounds for us. Miller. Um, yeah, I really, I really enjoy all of those circuits, so I like it here. Um, you know, if we can just... Uh, I need to, you know, like uh, a bit like Leon and Johnny, I guess, you know. The problem is, as a rider, you want it too badly sometimes, and you let that kind of... Uh, defect away from, from kind of working on the bike and getting everything right and then going for it and uh, I definitely sort of went sort of gung-ho this afternoon and thought right that's it you know here we go kind of the shaky show sort of thing but uh, yeah we just need to uh, we need to kick back and keep working the way we have been nice and methodical and get the bike good and then and then push hard. Well we're all taking our seats we're ready for the shaky show bring it on. <laughs> I'll be trying. Thanks man. Cheers. Cheers. Lovely.